this afternoon, should I say, is uh, planting some dwarf palms along the front here, just to give us a bit of shade. And just for an update, we had a earthquake of 6.2 this afternoon. Mm -hmm. And if you turn that way. And you turn that way. Hey, still standing. Look. Much to the dismay of the local yeah. neighbors that have all been coming past to see a, a pile of earth bags. It's very okay. So we've had reports that there's crack, big cracks in houses in the village. Yeah. Just give us a bit of shade in the afternoon because the house gets a lot of uh, sun in the afternoon. Mm, so and we've got some various fruit trees. Maris will have to tell you which ones they are. This sure. is orange and that's, um, I don't know what's that, but Jackie gave that to us. And this is Doyan from Thailand, like Thailand Bariti, Baritia, Thailand. Thailand Dorian, as you can see, the leaves is different, and that's a jackfruit. Uh, yeah, so we, the purpose, that's why we planted this in the front to shade every afternoon because it's the sun is over there, so like a little bit shady, and yeah. And now we started the, I know this second of the uh, dwarf and palm when we arrived from tagum because we didn't feel the earthquake when we arrived someone tell us that the house is like shaking shaking and it's, they thought it's gonna you know well that's why these houses are designed like this because it's they're like not, swing they're not fixed to a concrete foundation mm -mm. and they actually move Mm. with the earthquake rather than have rigid foundations and rigid walls mm. which can't move with the earthquake and then they fall down or mm. badly damaged and everything is okay no damage the other houses here in our neighborhood their post is cracked yeah it's cracked Mm, the walls but ours is fine but in the last 30 days we've mm. had a 6.1 mm -hmm. a 5.4 yeah and a 6.2 and yes that's it for today guys we just update for our this palm door palm for the front house yes this is like that seven of the dwarf palms planted as per Filipino standard the wife now wants to move all these fruit plants that's their favorite hobby double handling <laughs> so that's a job for her to do I'm not involved with that because I planted them once so I'm not doing it no more mm -hmm. but the rest of it all looks good So they should grow about the height of the house when they're fully grown. Mm -hmm. But they have a, <clears throat> most probably about six or seven foot of just trunk. Mm. So it won't be too dark at the front of the house. Hi guys, so today is March 8th. And we have visitor here. Don't you're from where you're from, sir? The Netherlands. From the Netherlands. Netherlands. And you and you? The Netherlands. Oh really? And you? 
you? The Netherlands. Oh, oh same, Netherlands. Wow, from you, from Europe, all European. Uh, it's Rio, a uh, European. Yeah. So they're visiting here in our Earthbug house today. Mm -hmm. 